Hello dear friends, today I will be playing Genshin Impact and I decided that in every video I will start with a beautiful quote. So today's quote is, to find happiness you need to find something to hold on to, something to motivate you and something to inspire you. So today what I'm gonna do in Genshin, so first of all I'm gonna collect something from mail. So it is something like version satisfaction or something like that. So I'm going to claim it. Um, okay. And so what I'm going to do. First of all, I'm going to go to Passage of Clouds and Stars and claim Intertwined Fate. Okay. And what I'm going to do now is to just go to Kaya's game. Okay, and so it will be near that elemental trial, um, like a domain something, or something like that. And so, um, I need to go forward. Hmm. Objects like this can prove useful in purging evil spirits. Arcadian ruins. Is it just me, or does it look plain? Oh, Paimon gets it. The perfect disguise is always in plain sight. Kaya's grandpa sure is impressive. Listen, Paimon. Oh, nice. You didn't even try, did you? Uh, it's no time to get suspicious. We're close. Hurry, the treasure is waiting for us. Okay, so I'm gonna go to this disguise or something like that. Lost Tracadia. Lost treasures reveal themselves only to those with true wisdom. Having solved the mystery of Arcadia, <laughs> you finally arrive at the site of the treasure. Okay, and so let's start with my best characters that I have. Okay, and what I see is absolutely nothing. Oh, sorry. A touch of frost. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to do this. Am I actually strong? Or I'm just... Wait, I want to try Lisa. She, she's doing 15. Ah! Using well, 50. 85? Oh wow, okay. Oh, okay, so. I, I didn't close. <gasps> I thought it would close by itself. Okay, and so what am I supposed to do? From whence you came! Fourth, my play! Be gone! Let it rain. I'm not sure what I'm doing actually, so... Oh, there's only one. Okay. Challenge is complete. <laughs> okay. That time is running away. My Cheng Yun. A little bit tight. Oh, but they don't wait. Ah, oh, is this the end? Where are you, my treasure? I think there will be no treasure. Let's look around! <laughs> How about you let me take over? The treasure hoarders? Sharp eye, but too slow. I'm Izzard. I thank you both on behalf of the treasure hoarders. Ah. Uh. We've been keeping a low profile. How did word get out? Low profile? Hmm. Paimon won't let you have the treasure without a fight. You would be wise not to underestimate us. My gang is just outside waiting for my order. However, they're not as uh, sociable as me. I'm sorry to rain on your parade, but your gang won't be participating in your current plan. It's Kaya. 
If you'd like to ask why, you can go see them. In Mondstadt Prison. Or perhaps you'd prefer to join them permanently. The Knights. Hey, it's Kaya! Kaya, he wants to steal your treasure! Get him! Oh, almost had it. Oh, you mean the treasure? Sorry, but there wasn't any treasure to begin with. You came all the way for nothing. Just give it up. What? No treasure? Did Kaya just say there isn't any treasure? Ha! <laughs> you got me good. Didn't think the knights would resort to such tactics. A thief has no right to criticize the methods of the knights of Fav Wait, what are you- You're not gonna get me! Okay. He's just oh, running away. Wh what is this? I didn't mean it. And it's a big, big monster. <laughs> what a troublemaker. You, knight! You're not gonna watch me die, are ya? Hmm. What an interesting suggestion. Fine. I I'll confess and go quietly. Please, just help me. All right, then. Guess I will have to do some overtime work after all. Submit for judgment. No escape. Freeze. Okay, so we die. How embarrassing. Having my life saved by a knight. Don't forget what you promised. Or that thing will be the least of your worries. Hey, is this how the Knights of Favonius treats the people they catch? <laughs> I'm just joking. All right, let's take him back. Sir! Yes, sir! Uh, Captain, should we take these two in as well? Uh, what? <laughs> of course not. They are the ones who made this arrest possible. Without them spreading our fabricated intel, we wouldn't have been able to catch the treasure hoarders. Okay, so there is no treasure. Ah, you're a bad man for lying to me! Shame on the knife! I like her crying. <laughs> all right, all right, stop it already. Though the treasure doesn't exist, you did want it for yourself, didn't you? Otherwise, you would have informed me of your intentions, no? That... well... uh... Hmm. Let's go! Paimon's done talking to him! <laughs> Just a sec. You did help me out, so you do deserve a reward. This is the triumphant Harbinger of Dawn that points towards victory. As its name suggests, it symbolizes light and victory. If you don't mind, I would like to present you with this Harbinger of Dawn as a reward. Harbinger of Dawn? That's right. It suits a well-cultured and disciplined person such as yourself. Wouldn't you say, Paimon? Well, if the reward is this Harbinger of Dawn... You'd forgive me, right? I'm honored to have such an understanding friend. Yes, yes. You have my apologies for the deception. I will not use the same method twice. Um, means you'll use a different method next time. What a wonderful day. Now, I have to go interrogate my suspect. He just ignored me. Please excuse said. me. Do come visit me at our headquarters when you have the chance. Okay, so secret part treasure is completed. And so I'm gonna get this precious chest. Oh, Harbinger, Harbinger of Dawn or something like that. And well, I'm gonna leave this domain. Okay, so now I'm gonna go to... Um, maybe let's go to Blight with the Wind. I think it is better. Oh, and so I want to try that weapon that I got. Even though I don't know what... Oh, I got this word. Okay, so I don't need it. <laughs> I'm gonna use this one. Even though I don't know what's so important about the... Oh, wow, wow, wow. Amber, you're gonna have a four-star bow. Changyun will have a great Favonius, great sword. Okay, I shall like Changyun. 
Oh, okay. So first of all, I'm gonna heal myself in near Windrise. And then, I'm gonna go to that quest. Can it heal me? I'm gonna look at it. Okay, so... It can't. I think so. Maybe statues, boss? Yeah. Oh, okay. So now I will talk with Amber. Hey, traveler! I've been looking for you everywhere. How's that wind glider I gave you last time? Um, pretty good. <laughs> Seems like it's really growing on you. But then again, you don't have a gliding license, do you? A gliding license? Hmm, what's that? <sighs> Isn't it obvious? You gotta have a gliding license to legally glide in Mondstadt. Oh, but we've been gliding for ages now. This is the first we've heard about it. Yeah, you've been gliding all over the place. Everyone's noticed. <laughs> so, you came looking for us because you want to give us a gliding license? No way! The Knights of Avonius have strict rules. You need to pass an exam, and only then will the Knights issue your license. Today, I'm here as an examiner to oversee your official gliding exam. I gave you your wing glider, so this is my responsibility. At least that's what acting Grandmaster Jean would say. An exam? <sighs> what a pain in the butt! Then again, since Amber is the examiner... I think I'll choose. It's fine. I can do this. I'm sure you'll glide through it. I mean, the whole city saw how well you flew the day that Storm Terror attacked, so I'm sure you'll have no problems. But, we do need to respect the rules and glide properly. Here, take this gliding manual. No need to memorize it, just be familiar with everything in there. For example, only one person per wing glider, no carrying anything over the set weight limit, no taking off using an animal slime, and so on and so forth. Anyway, be sure to read it, okay? I had to read a load of big, thick books too when Lisa was teaching me magic. Wow, that's a big old book! Paimon thinks we best get started. Great, come find me when you're done. I'll be at Windrise. So I will need to read, right? <sighs> the Knights of Avonia's gliding manual does not sound like a fun read. Well, I guess I better get started. When the first wisp of wind brushed across the land, birds that yearned for the sky had wings, but no way to fly. They asked the animal god, how can we reach the heavens? To which the animal god replied, you have yet to find that which is most important. As the god spoke, the wind thrust the seeds of a dandelion high into the sky. The birds thrust out their wings, but the breeze was all too mild, leaving them to stumble across the earth. So they went to the gorge, where the wind showed off its wild and incomparable strength. They threw themselves off the cliff and flapped their wings amongst the howling winds until they were able to fly freely in the sky. To the animal god they went to gleefully say, We understand now. All we needed was a stronger wind to fly. In reply, the animal god said, What you lacked was not wind, but courage. It is courage that has allowed you to become the first flying birds of this world. That's a beautiful story. Hmm, that's a cool story.
But is the Knight's Gliding Manual really written in that style? Um, I think it reads like a fairy tale. Huh. Anyway, let's go find Amber. So, new quest is started. Wind, Quarch, and Wings. Okay, so we will teleport there. At first, I was thinking maybe I should go to those um, Statue of Sevens, like all of those. Damn. There are a lot of them. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, whatever. Um, well, still, I'm gonna go to the nearest. And then I'm gonna just go further and further. And yeah. Okay, so first I'm gonna go to a Statue of Seven. So I'm gonna teleport here. And then I'll, um, I will go there. Prove useful in hurting evil spirits. <laughs> Hi, <laughs> have you seen a coin pouch anywhere? Um, what kind of coin pouch? It's made of cloth and has a thousand or more in it. That was my wage bet that I just received. It was okay, whatever. It will be a disaster if I can't find it. Okay, so now I'm gonna go there, but firstly what I want to do is go to those um, teleport weights. Okay, so let's go.
It looks like a chimpanzee um, arena or something like that. But probably that won't be chimpanzee because I've never heard that in Genshin there are monkeys. So yeah. Huh? No. Oh, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I hope I'm not gonna die. But I think I'm gonna die. It's so bad. Okay, I, mean, I didn't. Wow. <laughs> These are the perfect conditions for training. Come on, traveler. Train with me. Um, like I see, I probably can't go there. But but I will try still go there. Maybe there is a strong wind or something like that. What's this Korea called? Oh, I don't know. Mm, but I see that waypoint. And I see. Oh, right, that's what I see. I probably can't go there. Sadly. Sadly, I can't go there. Swift and merciful! <laughs> nope, I can't. Okay, so, well. There is um wait. Can you see this? Oh that wow, okay, whatever. I know how to climb up there. It's too high for me. Um I don't wanna go there again. But I can go here. Right? I'm not sure what it is. Or me oh, a key. A key that can break the seal on the ancient shrines of death. Steps, steps. Okay, there's probably something useful, right? Um well maybe. <laughs> Something will be useful someday. Rage, you're here. Did you have a good read through of the gliding manual? Got all the rules down? I can't say I really grasp the rules. Sounds like it was a real drag. I would know. I've been there. Ah, oh, the gliding manual is super dry. I couldn't get into it at all. <gasps> Don't tell Jean, though. Really? Hmm. Paimon thought there were some pretty cool stories in the gliding manual. Cool stories? Oh, you must mean the example cases in the appendix. Some of them I like. My favorite one is about the illegal animal slime takeoff. Apparently, if you pop an animal slime and take off in the burst of wind, it shoots you up really, really high. I really want to try it. No, not that story. Paimon meant the one with the little bird who wanted to learn to fly. Uh, what? Let me take a look. Oh, shoot. This is the storybook I used to read as a kid. Oops, sorry. I put both books in the same pile and must have grabbed the wrong one when I was leaving. 
How in the heck do you confuse a bedtime story with an instruction manual? Uh, uh this is so embarrassing. It's because, maybe deep down inside, that fairy tale is the thing that truly taught me how to glide. What you lacked was not wind. It's courage that's allowed you to become the first flying birds of this world. Reading that gave me the courage to glide, to become an outrider, and to become the gliding champion of Mondstadt. Uh, but anyway, let's get back to the exam. Don't be nervous. Just glide like you're used to. Okay then. You just need to follow the marked route to the finish. I'm ready. Okay, so I think it will be hard, like really hard. Okay. Okay. Well, I'm gonna succeed. I'm not sure, but I will try. given the way you handle your glider in a storm. The next part of the exam is in Mondstadt. See you there. Don't keep me waiting. Alrighty then. Okay, you heard so... her. Yeah, I heard her. <laughs> the city. Let's not keep her waiting. Okay, so... I'm gonna go there. Glide through the markers and get to the finish without stopping in the middle. I'm ready. That will be a thing harder. Okay. Yeah, it will be harder. Wait a bit, wait a bit, wait for me. Wait, how can you go up? Oh, that's how. Okay, now I understand. Where to go? Oh, here. Why on the roof? Why are you here? <laughs> How did you even climb up there? <laughs> Seems like you've got the hang of wind gliding now. Let's do the final stage. Easy! You've flown this way before anyway! Once you've passed this final stage, you'll finally be able to get your very own gliding license. Just keep thinking about that license. Ready? Go! Okay, okay. I can see... Okay, wait a bit for me. Wait for me. No. No, I skipped. I didn't. I skipped it. Wait, I'm not sure what am I supposed to... Windborne Traveler, you are required to land at once by the order of the Knights of Pavonius. I no one told. Oh. Uh, what's going on? Please show me your gliding license. I, um, my um, gliding license is. Uh... It is against the law to glide without a license. I am arresting you under Section Seven, Article Twelve of the Mondstadt Penal Code. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say will forever carry on the wind. Wait, I'm an instructor. This is a gliding exam. Oh, I see. Well, you picked a bad time to hold your gliding exam. Really? Why? The Knights of Favonius received a report from a sister at the cathedral, claiming she saw Raptor gliding around these parts. I thought your student here must have been his partner in crime. Raptor? Who's that? A known criminal in Mondstadt. He always uses a wind glider to commit his crimes, so people started calling him Raptor. Wow, he flies fast then. So far, we haven't managed to catch him. 
Our plan this time was to draw him into the cathedral with a precious artifact and ambush him inside. But he escaped with the artifact. Fortunately, one of the sisters put some secret markings on the artifact using elemental magic. But he was too fast, and we couldn't even keep up with the trail the markings left behind. Well, if you need help chasing down a gliding criminal, I'm the one for the job. So tell me, which way did he go? As far as I know, he was last seen near Springvale. But that was some time ago. Leave it to me. With us chasing him down together, he doesn't stand a chance. Sure. Once we've got this raptor guy, we'll pick up where we left off. But no need to worry. I'll be sure to have a word with Jean. Okay, and so... So we'll need to go somewhere there. Oh, I can teleport just... And go over there. So, okay. This is Springvale. There must be some clues about Raptor around here. The sister from the cathedral put some secret animal markings on the artifact he took. Use your elemental sight and keep your eyes peeled for clues. And how to use my elemental sight? Oh, okay. Oh, oh, okay, okay. Ooh, hey, what do you think this is? Um, it looks like a broken tree branch. Oh, I got nose it's from a frame of a wing glider. Therefore, there are no elemental traces on it. Oh, it looks like it's just a plain old tree branch. Not sure where am I supposed to go. Um, well, I guess I would just go. Oh, there. Are... And why do I need those elemental something? Hmm. A strip of cloth with animal markings on it. Looking at the design and the way it's woven, there's a good chance it came from a wing glider. Wow, outriders have to be textile experts now? It's a harder job than Paimon thought. Hmm. How do we know if this was left by raptor or an animal slime? Animal slimes are airborne creatures. They don't leave marks on the ground unless someone stumped on one to take off. Hmm. How do we know if this was left by raptor or an animal slime? Either way, let's make a mental note of these markings. They're very clear. It appears that the elemental markings point this way. Huh. Well, do you think he ran off ahead? There's only one way to find out. Come on, we should keep following the markings. Ooh, what's that? Looks like something's going on up ahead. It sounds like there's a battle going on. Could that be Raptor? Quick, let's keep going. Okay, so let's go. If this really belongs to Raptor, it must mean his wind glider is broken. Viewpoint. Oh, wow. Land of Clear Springs added to Archie. Archie. I'm not sure how to say it. Okay, so I would just need to go there. Oh, village rolls. Village rolls. Melly village rolls. Blitz. Oh. Wind blade. Oh, my God. Oh, something. Thank goodness. The Knights of Favonius have arrived. The hilly trolls won't dare pursue me any longer. What happened? I can't believe it, but the hilly churls attacked our carts. <sighs> Luckily, I outran them. Hilly churls? But I thought the Knights of Avonius had cleared out most of the hilly churl camps around these parts. It's a small camp not too far from the village, but the route I take on my delivery runs ensures I steer clear of it. But today, oh, some crazy fellow suddenly fell out of the sky and landed right in the camp. Now, who does that remind me of? Oh, it really riled them up. They chased the funny-looking fellow as he fled, which brought them out in the open. I managed to get away, but they smashed my fruit carts to smithereens. Oh, I don't know what I'm going to do when the merchant caravan gets here tomorrow. Funny-looking? In what way? 
He was holding on to something. Must have been heavy because he couldn't glide in a straight line to save his life. Maybe that's why he fell. Honestly, people like that shouldn't be allowed in the skies. It doesn't take a genius to know you're not supposed to carry heavy objects while gliding. I'm gonna report that idiot and make sure he gets his license revoked. Heavy object? The artifact? This could well be our guy. Tell me, did you see which way he went? Uh, I managed to catch a glimpse as I ran from the hilly churls. I think he went that way. Seems like a strong lead. On with the chase! Oh, and don't worry. As soon as I get back, I'll tell the knights to mop up the rest of the hilly churls as soon as possible. Okay. So now I'm gonna look for Rakt. I need to use my... Oh, it appeared to be ambush? Oh, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Another test subject. Let it rain. From whence you came, you're open. I'm not sure what I'm doing. Oh, Suffocate. Uh, I'm really sore. Oh, I'm test subject. Uh, uh, Apart from the hilly churls, there's a bunch of funny-looking people, too! Judging from the type of wind gliders they've got, I'd say Wait, this lot is with Raptor. But oh, if that's okay. the case, what are they hanging around here for? I wonder... Well, oh, this measly bunch can't pole. slow us down, okay. that's for sure. Look where we are! There are no more elemental markings ahead. The elemental power on the artifact must have worn off. Raptor must have realized the markings would give away his position and sent his minions to slow us down. That way, when the effect wears off, he can make his escape. He won't get away with this. After him! But we also haven't found the artifact, which means Raptor still has it on him. Okay. Forget these guys. Come on, let's keep following the elemental markings. Okay. But I'm gonna stop here, and so bye!